you guys welcome back to my channel on today's video i am going to do a dollar tree haul it's been a minute since i last did one of these and i've been buying stuff from dollar tree i just haven't been showing it um but i only been buying the things that i really need from dollar tree that i really don't have time to go like to walmart or other places to get so i just been going to um dollar tree and getting them so, yeah, let's get straight into this video. But before I do, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, all of those good things. And hit the notification bell because it will help your girl out. And, um, yeah, subscribe. What are you doing? And for all the newcomers, thank you guys for joining my channel. I greatly appreciate it. Um, let me know in the comment section of more videos you guys would like to see. I am here to be of assistance to you guys. So, let's go ahead and get started. First thing I want to get started since I'm trying to clean up my living room is because uh, I'm not sure who asked me if I find your comment. I place it somewhere on my screen if I accepted it. Because YouTube just started siphoning through my comments and majority of them are not making it under the videos. I have to go and accept them. But I did see your video, I mean your comment. And I'm here to answer your question. You asked me where I get all of my notebooks from because notebooks are expensive. And you like to write just like I do. So, girl, this is what I'm going to tell you. Go to Dollar Tree, okay? Sometimes Walmart do have notebooks around by school time where you can get them for like 50 cents or 75 cents. But if you're trying to get it like any other season, then it's best to go to Dollar Tree, um... Even if you do go to Walmart out of season, I mean, they might have some, but they probably went back up on to regular price. But I got this book, <clears throat> Level Up, and I also got this book, and you will see this again in an upcoming video, but I got this book from um, Dollar Tree, and the Dollar Tree got a, not a company, but they got a smaller company called Crown Jewels. Um, it's women owned. And these are who make these kind of composition notebooks. And I love composition notebooks because I just do. Um, and then you could create them. They give you spots to write what it really is. And these books were basically for a classroom. Because if you open it, it has this up in there. So that's the reason why it was basically made for a classroom. But to me, I use I'm going to use that schedule for something else since I have so much stuff to do this time of year. So yeah, that's something that I had got from um Dollar Tree. And if you want to, this is like the name of it. Um so yeah, I got those from Dollar Tree. Also, if you guys don't know, I have a a OCD problem that people tell you so I went and found at first when I was working for Dollar Tree I found a lot of antibacterial things that I would like to add to my collection but then um, I stopped working for Dollar Tree because of, her, of the whole tobacco and I will put that video below so you guys can know what happened but um Aquarelle they came out with some antibacterial anti wet wipes. And I take them everywhere. Um, right now, I am using their big pack. Um, their big pack, I use it when I'm getting ready to um, check my sugars. When I'm getting ready to eat. Things like that. And I'm out in the public, I use these. Um, and they come in handy. Um... And I'm especially on vacation. I especially stick like two or three in my in my um in my suitcase and just go with it. But since I was working there and I believe they just came out with them, you get these little smaller packs for like fifteen in a pack. Um, and they come two in a box. So I got real happy about that because I could stick this in my purse, stick it in my suitcase. Stick it in my overnight bag instead of just going out buying this when I just need like a little pack. I just can stick that in my purse and go. Um, 
Another thing I want to talk to you guys about is, well, show you guys what I got. It's the hand sanitizer. I got that, and it comes into, like, lavender and things like that. But I I feel like I'm allergic to lavender because every time I get anything lavender, spray, soap, tissue paper, always breaks out. And the last time I broke out from lavender, it wasn't a pretty sight because it was tissue paper. So I'm like, no, lavender, no. So I got some um some sanitizers that got uh, aloe and vitamin E in it, and it actually doesn't dry up my skin like I thought it would along with that um I usually didn't buy hand soap from Dollar Tree because I thought their hand soap was like super watered down but I guess when they went up on their prices they went up and got some better products and this is when I found their Nouveau Fresh Peach hand soap and you guys it's actually jailed like it's actually hand soap that you get from Walmart and it's not super watery okay I hate watered down hand soap um and I hate to go to stores that got like they put like water in their hand soap to stretch it to make it better but to me that's not even getting your hands clean it's like you cleaning your hands with water so anyways and the next two products I'm about to show you guys you guys will um, see them again because I do want to do like a a good review on these because they kind of help me out a lot so yeah why not and it's the Pons Light Moisturizer and I'm pretty sure you guys have seen it because if you've seen bottles like this it usually be the dull that's like these um even the cocoa butter has it like this so yeah and then also they have the Pons Michael uh, Makeup Remover Facial Whites uh, with aloe vera extract. And you get like 10. And it's these right here. And then, you know, it went in but $1.25. But you know, at Walmart, that little pack right there is like $5. So I feel like I did get a deal on it. Now, is that something that I would constantly buy? I'm not sure. But how hot it is, it actually cools my face down when I'm in the heat. So I won't get a suntan. If I do get a suntan, it won't burn as bad as it would if I just let it sit into my skin. Also, for all my diabetics out there, I have found the best lotion. I have been looking for this lotion for the longest. Even though it's under another brand. I still appreciate that they put it in Dollar Tree because it's nothing but a dollar and I'm the only one that's going to be using it. Um, so yeah, and plus I don't have it out for everybody to use and yeah, it helps a lot. And it's under the extra care brand. Majority of everything I have up here is extra care except for the hand soap and the antibacterial uh, white, wet wipes and this is the oatmeal um, moisturizing lotion and I love this lotion so if you're a diabetic cuz I don't look into some of that diabetic lotion in Walmart and other places it's like ten plus dollars and right now it's not fitting my budget to go out and buy ten dollars for a lotion it's not gonna fit my budget so I rather go to a Dollar Tree and get my oatmeal lotion as much as I need and, and be done with that. Now this oatmeal lotion is probably going to last me um, at least two or three months because it is pretty. It's like eight, eight ounces but it came pretty full and plus you only need a little bit because it's kind of thick. Well not super thick. It's, it's, it reminds me of Vaseline. It's that kind of thick. So, yeah. But anyway, that's my little haul that I had to show you guys dealing with um, Dollar Tree. Um, I do have, like, some more things I want to show you guys because my living room looks a mess with all this stuff in it that I have to do a review on. But I do want to show you guys this because, yeah, this is the little haul that I got from Dollar Tree. Um, I've been holding on to this stuff for... A week now 
So yeah. But anyways, that's the end of this video. This is the videos I have to show you guys about that. I do have things to show you that I have got from Amazon. I really didn't get a lot of stuff from Amazon. Just something for myself. But anyway, this is the end of this video. If you guys would like to see more videos like this in the future, just let me know in the comment section below. Make sure you always check out my description box because you guys, I am still doing the giveaway, okay? And no one has reached out to me except for two people. And I'm still waiting on that last person. But anyways, um, that's about it on that. Um... Yeah, so, anyways, I'll see you guys in my next video. Always remember, be safe out there. Um, watch your back. Keep God first, and anything that you plan to do will fall in place. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Be blessed, guys.